my video this video is the continuation of my previous video louis pasteur in this video we are going to see how louis pasteur developed vaccine against anthrax following the success of the chicken cholera vaccination experiment pasteur focused on the microbial origin of disease pasteur began investigating anthrax at that time an anthrax epidemic in france and in some other parts of europe had killed a large number of sheep and the disease was attacking humans as well pasteur wanted to apply the principle of vaccination to anthrax meanwhile german physician robert koch was busy with the anthrax problem in germany it was robert koch who discovered the typical bacilli with squirish end in the blood of cattle that had died of anthrax he also discovered the resistant spores of this bacterium louis pasteur grew the microbes in laboratory flasks after isolating them from the blood of animals that had died of the disease pasteur confirmed its causative role by subculturing this bacterium 100 times without altering the high virulence of the pathogen he tried to attenuate its virulence by preventing spore formation this was achieved by maintaining live bacilli in the presence of oxygen in optimal conditions live bacilli were grown for 8 days in ventilated culture broth incubated at 42 to 43 degrees celsius bacilli progressively lose their virulence becoming harmless in animals such as rabbits sheep and guinea pigs he conducted a large scale public experiment of anthrax immunization pasteur immunized farm animals and the experiment was a complete success this convinced many people that pasteur's work was indeed valid these demonstrations explained the principle involved in elber jenner's successful use of cowpox virus in 1798 to immunize people against smallpox pasteur called the attenuated cultures vaccines a term derived from the latin vacca meaning cow pasteur was honoring jenner when he applied the term vaccination to immunization with attenuated cultures of bacteria that had no connection with cows here we have to note one more thing that is louis pasteur and robert koch independently provided definitive experimental evidence that the anthrax bacillus was indeed responsible for the infection this firmly established the germ theory of disease which then emerged as the fundamental concept of medical microbiology it is often said that english surgeon edward jenner discovered vaccination and pasteur invented vaccines friends i'm concluding this video here and in my next video we will be seeing how louis pasteur developed the rabies vaccine thank you friends